Hi all, I'm delighted to announce King's Crusher Tactics Snacks Free is now available and I've even got the t-shirt for an earlier uh, snacks. So okay, so if you like chat make puzzles, do you like playing on faster time controls? Would you like to build your pattern recognition by winning patterns? Uh, so let's have a look if you do. So browse and we'll pick one or two from the start of each chapter for this quick preview, quick look inside. So adrenaline, high adrenaline, queen d5. Okay, I think here check is good. We pin the queen and then actually we can quickly checkmate. When up against the clock, it's good to find those checkmates. Let's have a look at another. Okay, so here this was against actually, uh, it is either an international master or grandmaster. I was very delighted for this game. I think he might actually be a GM in that game. Uh, if you want to check that game out as well, you can check the games out. Uh, so you can see it was quite actually a positional. <laughs> well, he let me have space in the opening, so check that out. I think he went wrong in the opening there. Uh, so you can always check the games out to see how you got those positions. Now here again, celebrating the pin piece. The power of the pin is illusionary. Queen B2 is checkmate. So that's something I always try and celebrate when there's pins in the position. Let's go to another chapter. Okay, so here. Now this, it looks as though there might be a rook sack, but it might be better sometimes just to double. That's a, almost a tactic in its own right when you double your, your heavy pieces and go in uh, for the kill usually. And now with that pawn there covering an escape square, queen h7 is checkmate. So uh, sometimes simple as effective, just doubling. Now here, okay, it looks as though it looks as though uh, it might be tempting to play h4, but what about king takes g4? So actually there might be something sneakier here to try and get coordination on h4. So a backward knight retreat gives us knight f5 here. Let's try this. Now we're threatening queen h4, and that was parried, but now h4 is a lot more effective. And in fact, the opponent uh, resigned. It is a crushing attack on the h file. Okay. Uh, so here, after taking, I think here is check, and then knight takes f3 is check and mate. Okay, let's go to another chapter. And against my friend Mike here, I think there's something sneaky that I've done because he's given up his light square bishop. I'm celebrating the light squares with bishop h3 with tempo. Check. And now we can even use f7. Okay, I think he, uh, so. I won the exchange there, and in fact, he gave up at this point. Uh, okay, or did he? No, it carried on here. Sorry, pardon me. Carried on here, and then e5, and it did go on to the better checkmate there. So that's just showing winning the exchange there after. Okay. Algorithm. So here, I think Knight F3 is is simple and strong. And even if White wins E4, uh, it doesn't matter here. There's, I think, there's a real killer tactic here. Well, there's Bishop takes H2, <laughs> protected by the Rook. So uh, yeah, that H file is often winning me games. The H file type attacks, like here, Knight F3 looks plausible for Queen H2. And yeah, you can have a lot of fun with these little exercises. Maybe you're on a train or something on a bus. You want a quick, light uh, puzzles just to stimulate your brain, like morning coffee. Okay, here the light squares are weak. I think we can threaten mate, and they missed the threat there. Or well, it was very difficult to do something about it. So there. Okay, this one. I think we can. Uh, play queen takes f7. Yes, queen takes f7. Now here, okay, maybe knight h5. It looks really dangerous, but then we we lose the a uh, the queen square. Maybe just check instead. No, 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 no. Knight h5. It was okay. Knight h5. All right. So now, how about knight f6 here or knight f6 looks. Dangerous. 
nope i'm getting this all wrong this one <laughs> uh, actually much better than knight f6 knight f4 that threatens uh all sorts of things uh including knight g6 that would at least win the queen now knight takes e6 might be good to take away f8 and now check oh no 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 here then knight takes e6 yes this is the one i've got <laughs> managed to get completely wrong <laughs> okay uh hoggy <laughs> hoggy okay here it looks as though this is a more simple one queen f2 and we can come down to h2 and uh, let's have a look at this one okay so here uh what about rook takes h4 that looks tempting for knight f3 check oh rook g8 yes <laughs> of course of course and taking here is checkmate okay so as you can see uh, they do need some accuracy. It is easy to get them wrong. The the solutions have been checked uh, to to match uh, the the winning moves from the stockfish angle. So it, there is accuracy involved. Like here, you might think taking the queen, but actually queen g8 is is actually a better way to do this. And in fact, if the king comes up here, don't even have to take the queen. Uh, queen d6, and then and then that is mating with queen c5. Uh, so yeah, some of them are a little bit trickier, as you've seen, and even I'm, I'm stumbling. But it is early in the morning, that's my excuse. <laughs> okay, I hope you have fun with this. So King's Crusher Tactics Snacks free, and check out the other two as well. The other two has got have got good reviews, uh, above four point five, I believe, both of them at the moment. So uh, that's pretty cool. Hope you check that out. Thanks very much. Uh, the Bitly link, if you want to check it out, is. Uh, there 301 small m small t capital r small b i'll put the link in the description and the pinned comment as well okay hope you have fun with that thanks very much